Okay, now we untwisted the back. Let's see what type of battery it has. It has a 360, 377 or 366, uh, 626 battery, which is pretty standard battery as far as we can see. Uh, yeah, actually it's 621 or 364. It's a little thinner than 377 or 626. Uh, so we are going to install the back cell battery this time, as usually, because we have them in stock. And uh, they are very good batteries. We never had any problems with them. They don't leak or anything like that. As, at least on our experience, we had never had any problems. If anybody had, please let us know, shoot an email message. We'll be glad to learn, as we always do. There you go, you gotta make sure that you place these small metal pieces that are um, connected to the button. I mean, not connected, but they use used by buttons to press the mechanism um, parts to work so the watch is operating working nicely so we'll just close the back twist it on and then use the machine like this to tighten the back to make sure that it's uh, water resistant is going to be water resistant again because it's a 10 ATM watch um, meaning like it's a about 100 feet if we don't make a mistake or 100 meter meters which is uh, even more than 100 feet which is about 254 feet uh, being precise okay so just make sure you do it nicely, don't scratch the back of the watch. fix it, we close it and it's now tight and everything is nice and fits so we're gonna place put the time and we're gonna put the day two today's uh, 23rd there we go the chronometer and a small handle here working so thank you guys for watching we apologize for taking a little longer because the back was pretty tight so it took us some time to open it and um, once again thank you for watching put the thumbs up subscribe and uh, if you don't like something please let us know we'll try to fix it next time this was a tbtwatches.com with you thank you